Fortnite Chapter 5. Season 4 has introduced a whole new level of excitement with the addition of Shadow Briefings. Originally making their debut back in Chapter 5 Season 2, these briefings have now become a key part of the game, offering players new ways to tackle challenges, earn rewards, and build up their gold bars. This season, the Shadow Briefings are scattered all across the Battle Royale Island during the Absolute Doom season, and they come with an updated armory type and several new locations to explore. Each shadow briefing is designed to help players complete quests and earn gold bars, which can be crucial for getting ahead in the game. In this guide, we're going to cover everything you need to know about these briefings, from where to find them, what kinds of tasks you'll be taking on, and how to make sure you're completing them efficiently. Let's start with shadow briefing locations. In Chapter 5, Season 4, the briefings are spread out across the map, and they come in five different types, each offering its own set of challenges. Whether you're into combat, exploration, or just racking up loot, there's a shadow briefing for you. Here's a breakdown of the types. First up is the Armory Shadow Briefing. This one is all about weapon challenges. You'll need to eliminate enemies using a set of four different weapons that are provided in the briefing. It's perfect for those who like to switch up their combat style and test their skills with a variety of weapons. Plus, it's a great way to build up your arsenal quickly. Next, we have the Supply Drop Shadow Briefing. In this challenge, your goal is to secure supply drops that land in marked locations around the map. These drops are loaded with high-tier loot, so grabbing them will definitely give you an advantage in the game. The Supply Drop Shadow Briefing is one of the easier ones to complete, so it's a good idea to knock this one out early if you're looking to rack up gold bars. Then there's the Vehicle Shadow Briefing. As the name suggests, this one is all about using vehicles. You'll be tasked with driving a certain distance, performing stunts, or reaching specific destinations. This challenge is a lot of fun and adds a dynamic element to the game, especially if you enjoy high-speed, action-packed gameplay. The Plunder Shadow Briefing takes a different approach, Instead of combat or vehicle challenges, you'll be searching for rare chests buried at marked locations on the map. It's perfect for players who love scavenger hunts and exploration. Completing this briefing will reward you with valuable loot that can make all the difference in a tight battle. Finally, there's the Bounty Shadow Briefing, where you're tasked with hunting down a specific enemy player and eliminating them within a set time limit. This briefing is ideal for players who thrive under pressure and enjoy high-stakes combat. If you're able to complete this challenge, you'll be rewarded with gold bars and the satisfaction of a well-executed takedown. To accept a shadow briefing, you'll need to find a shadow terminal, which are scattered across the map. Once you locate a terminal, simply interact with it to accept the briefing. The terminal will assign you a specific task, and you'll need to complete it before the timer runs out. Once you've accepted a briefing, the real challenge begins. Tasks can range from collecting items, securing supply drops, or eliminating enemies. It's essential to keep track of your time, especially in the more combat-heavy briefings like the Bounty Shadow Briefing, where the pressure to complete the task can be intense. If you're looking for some tips on how to get the most out of Shadow Briefings, planning your drop is crucial. Try to land in areas that have multiple Shadow Terminals, as this will allow you to accept and complete more than one briefing in a single game. Prioritizing easier briefings, like the Supply Drop and Vehicle Shadow briefings, is also a smart move since they usually don't require much combat, making them less risky to complete. Staying mobile is another key strategy. Vehicles can be used not only for completing the Vehicle Shadow briefing, but also for quickly traveling between terminals and avoiding enemy encounters. Keeping yourself on the move will help you complete tasks more efficiently and stay ahead of your opponents. To wrap things up, Mastering Shadow Briefings in Fortnite. Chapter 5, Season 4 is a great way to boost your gameplay. By understanding the different types of briefings, knowing where to find them, and having a strategy in place, you can turn these challenges into opportunities for better loot, more gold bars, and faster quest completion. Whether you're capturing supply drops, pulling off vehicle stunts, or taking down enemy players, there's a shadow briefing that fits your playstyle, 